All right. I'm going to start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to the elect. Um, I just wanted to do a video focusing in on death. The brother in the camp had did a video focusing in on destruction. And as we know, the apostles, through the through the uh, spirit of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, have been pushing that this is the year of death, destruction, and, and diligence, okay? So I want to focus in on that word death, all right? Because we're about to see here in America and abroad a mass amount of death, okay? And um, contrary to popular belief, this death is going to come by the hands of the one that you ignorantly call God, okay? And like I said, contrary to popular belief, because um, everybody think that God is all love, you know, and that he wouldn't dare do something like that. And, you know, I, I, I read a, a comment on a comment board, and it was just saying, you know, back on the Eddie Long thing, that God wouldn't do that. God wouldn't, you know. But I'm going to go into the scriptures and just prove this point through the spirit of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, that death is issued by the one that you ignorantly call God, whose name is Yahweh, okay? I'm going to get right into it. These ain't no deep scriptures. They uh really don't need breaking down, okay? And I'm going to start off with uh, Psalms 68 and 20. It says, He that is our God is the God of salvation. And unto God, the Lord, belongeth the issues from death. All right? So that's plain. Okay? I'm going to get another scripture. This is Deuteronomy uh, 32 and 39. It says, See now that I, even I, am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. So, hey, it's the Heavenly Father, man. This is his program. Everything, Satan take his instructions from the Heavenly Father, just like all the rest of the angels. Every, Everything that happens is the will of the one that you ignorantly call God, okay? Whose name is Yahweh. All right, this is the, um, let me get another scripture this is 1 Samuel 2 and 6. It says, The Lord killeth and maketh alive. He bringeth down to the grave and bringeth up. Okay? That's plain. And get another scripture. This is the book of Tobit. Chapter 13. And I'm going to start at verse 1 and read through 2. It says, Then Tobit wrote a prayer of rejoicing and said, Blessed be God that liveth forever, and blessed be his kingdom. For he doth scourge and hath mercy. He leadeth down to hell and bringeth up again. Neither is there any that can avoid his hand. Shit. That's plain. All right? Get another scripture. This is, um, I'll bring this one back. This is, uh, Wisdom of Solomon 16 and 13. For thou hast power of life and death. Thou leadest to the gates of hell and bringest up again. Really saying the same thing, okay? <laughs> I'm going to bring out one more scripture. This is Isaiah 45 and 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, Yahweh, do all these things. He's the one that calls all the shots, man. Okay? So all this death that's about to take place is going to take place by the hands of the Heavenly Father. By Him... Issue it not this death, man. To him belong the issues of death, okay? So, 
I just wanted to make that short and brief. You know, hopefully the elect was edified. Got some precepts, you know. And um, I'm going to just end it right there. It ain't nothing deep. Just nice, brief, quick. Just focusing on death, man. Because we about to see a lot of it, you know. <laughs> because we're at the end of this thing, man. And it's evident, man. You know. Um, matter of fact, I'm going to bring out one more scripture and I'm going to end it on this. This is Romans. Locking. Romans 13 and verse 11 it says and that knowing the time that now it is high time to wake out of sleep for now is our salvation nearer than when we believe and we believe it's near you know so it's nearer than what we believe okay and I'm going to end it right there I'm going to say all praises to Yahweh Ba'asham Yahweh Shah double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone and peace and blessings to the elect. Shalom.